and like I walk up to the thing and I go, can I get two for Chappie? And she goes, oh, um, will it be military discount? And I'm like, oh, no, it won't be. Well, we'll, 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 yeah, yeah. Okay, anyways. Welcome, everybody. This is Axel Skeleton. I am Phil. I'm Luis. And we are here to discuss the movie Chappie. Chappie. The new film directed by Neil Blomkamp, starring Patel. The, the, the guy the, from, uh, from Slumdog, Slumdog Millionaire. Slumdog Millionaire, yeah, there yes. you go. And, yeah, and, and, and M. Night Shyamalan's uh, The Last Airbender. Yeah, the, um, uh, oh, what the fuck is his name? Prince Zuko. Yes. Zuko was yes. in that shit. And there's Ch also Hugh Jackman, uh, Sigourney Weaver. And For like five minutes. Yeah. Um, there was a robot. There was a robot who's voiced by Charlotte Capo. Fucking fuck! What are you fucking fuck? What are you fucking fucking man? What are you fucking fucking man? Yeah, I love doing that impression. This, this episode is going to be NC-17. Yes. Just letting y'all know. Yes. It's going to get really, really ugly. South African style. Oh, yeah. Oh, what are you fucking fuck? Oh, and and, uh, and the that South African hip-hop group. Oh, uh, What are they called? They're terrible. Uh, say uh, it. Di say Di it. Di Diane Word. Yeah, Di that, that, them motherfuckers. Check them out. I don't know who they are, but I like, listened to their music. Drunk, I, heard, I heard their music during the movie, and I was like, this is horrible, but it fits this movie very good and here's what we're talking about okay so this movie was ridiculous it was uh, it was heavily flawed there's plot holes everywhere um, but at the end I still liked it I had a good time watching it uh, I tried not to watch it too much as like this little critic dude but yeah you I mean I couldn't help but notice that there, this movie was flawed look man we're not we're not here to be Siskel and Ebert we're not here to be Siskel and Roper we're not here to be you know Siskel Ebert and Roper and, whatever they're all <laughs> Never mind. I wasn't yeah. even gonna go there. Um, <laughs> but but yeah. So we're not trying to be that. We're trying to just give you like a, 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 a <clears throat> an analysis that you can go to the movie with and just be like, you know what? They were right. You know, it wasn't it wasn't bad. Yeah. It wasn't great. But yeah. you know, and and that was the thing that the movie was good. It had its fun parts. Um, there it was definitely flawed. But I laughed more. It was one of those movies where it's like it's so bad that it's good. Kind of thing. I feel like Neil Blomkamp was perfect for this movie. I don't yeah. know if he wrote it or I know he directed it. That's all I know. I think um, he wrote half of it. The, the violence and, and, and the uh, the greediness and the, the 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 style of it just fits perfectly for this movie. Um, it's like a super R-rated version of Circuit. Yeah. Okay. Pretty much. Yeah. And like, and I just felt like Neil Blomkamp with just some had real steel in there. Some real, a little um, bit of real because, steel, a little bit uh, of Robocop. Yeah. Oh, big Robocop. Big Robocop. The, the bad guy from Robocop makes his return. To Ed two oh nine. You know, this this movie, this movie is to that robot what the wrestler was to Mickey Rourke. Yeah. Revitalizes career. Absolutely. Completely. completely. This Wait. motherfucker's about to. He's about to uh, come. He's about to be in the new uh, Scorsese movie. Yeah. And he's gonna get the Oscar. You heard it here first. And that's how we acknowledge the uh, Robocop remake. Goddamn right. Never happened. <laughs> <laughs> so, I mean, alright, so if you were to rate it, how would you go? I would go, uh, like 1.5 to 2, you know? Somewhere, yeah. somewhere, like 1.75. Like, this is, this is a first for Axel Skeleton. <laughs> I'm giving a fraction <laughs> that we had not yet discovered. We're doing 1.75 is what I'm giving it. I want to go 2. No, no, no fractions, no decimals. I'm, I'm gonna give it a solid two skulls out of five. He failed and, algebra, and that's and, why. <laughs> <laughs> I made it past part two. Yeah. <laughs> but, but, Shout um, out to Prudhomme. Prudhomme! Shout out to Prudhomme! Carlton! <laughs> Anyways, yeah, I give it a two because, yeah, at the end, like I said, I liked the movie. It was heavily flawed with all the plot holes in it. Um, I would give it, a, 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 the reason why I give it a, a two, and I think I'm just being generous with that, is because I feel like it's a unique film. Like, you, Neil Blomkamp took this and just made it its own thing. You'll never see a movie anything quite like it. Mm -hmm. It's uh, very cheesy, especially in that third act. That third act, I was just like, okay, now I'm just having fun. I just, yeah, I just, yeah, it just, I just shut said, off, I just yeah, shut you, off my brain. Yeah, you just said, yeah. fuck the story. Um, yes. I, I, I agree with you with what you said. Um, I'm, I'm a little disappointed that Dev Patel was in a movie and there was no firebending. Yeah. But um, it was still cool. Yeah. Um, 
So, yeah, it, it's crazy. Yeah. All right. Yeah, and that's all we got to say about Chappie. So, uh, until next time, look, be on the lookout for the next episode of the podcast. Check us out. Leave, what did you think about Chappie? Let us know in the comments Go watch below. the movie watch and it. let us know. It's, it's a fun. I it's mean, you, fun. Can, you can go ahead and disagree with us and just say yeah. we're scumbags yes. and we don't know what the hell we're talking about. And, and make it's, sure it's, just, it's, I mean, it's heavily because I don't know about you, but I don't have my life together. So, um, that's why I'm not a reliable source. But, you know. You're preaching to the choir, yeah. baby. <laughs> yeah. So you know? wh whatever you thought about the movie, leave it in the comments below. Be on the lookout for the next episode of the podcast. And look out for a, a future giveaway that I've been talking about so much, but I'm finally going to do it now. Oh, so, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so until then, stay focused, stay sharp, and Axiola. Axiola. Good night. Bye.